today I wanted to talk about DJing weddings on off days. And I'll be honest, an off day wedding sometimes has a bit of a different vibe. What can you expect on an off day wedding? Well, normally the time is gonna be a little bit earlier. So for example, this wedding started a little bit earlier and it ended a little bit earlier. I think the last song I played was right around 9.45. Like I usually kind of warm the crowd up a little bit, play a couple of filler songs, if you will. Not last night. I came out of the gate swinging with some of my best tracks because I wanted to engage them early. And then if they were thinking about looking at their watch and thinking about going to work the next day, that they put that out of their mind and were like, nah, hell no, we're staying. This DJ is killing it. You got to really change your mindset when you have to do these off day weddings or these Sunday weddings. You know, again, these people paid you a lot of money. They want you to be there. They want you to kick ass at their reception. And that's what you got to do. If you got to start to change your mindset around noon when it's time to shower and put that suit on, do that. Check yourself. Remember that you're a paid entertainment. You're a professional and you got to go out there and kick some butt.